and are off. Hello, Gracie and Quick Strike. First away, Golden Moonshine speeding up there, and Poets Princess on the rail going to chime in too. So it's Golden Moonshine, the head in front from Quick Strike in second, length and a half, and Poets Princess spying the speed from third. My Way or Else on the outside, racing in fourth position, and Keyed Up is next. And hello, Gracie and Awfully Foxy is trailing the field, only six on the pacemaker. Golden Moonshine pressed by Quick Strike. Golden Moonshine now three quarters of a length from Quick Strike second. My Way or Else on the inside in third. Hello, Gracie is in fourth, and Poets Princess is next and keyed up, and Awfully Foxy now eight lengths to come. At the 5 16th pole, and it's still Golden Moonshine a narrow lead from Quick Strike in second. Hello, Gracie firing up a three wide bid just in behind them. Is my way or else, and my way or else is saving ground another stretch. Has an opening to come through if good enough. They're followed by keyed up, and then it's back to Awfully Foxy Poets Princess for a long left to go. Hello, Gracie. Hello, Gracie powers out of the lead. It opens up now. Hello, Hello, Gracie's in front from my way or else. So the center of the track is keyed up. And awfully foxy try to pick up a share with a 16th to go. Hello, Gracie. Hello, Gracie's 9 to 1 to win it by 2 and a half from keyed up second. And my way or else, awfully foxy. Seven and a photo in a minute 12.52. Mankelin Creek is six to five. Off of the mile run. Chico Con Alex fired up with the blinkers on on the outside, gunning out for that early lead. Keep your guard up with early speed, too. Tiny Tin settles back there, and Goldie's boy up close to another two and a half lengths, and it's Laurel Ladd who's racing about five or six lengths off the early speed. Pat's Factor and Strictly Business racing back of the pack with last Manklin Creek. So charging on the back stretch run now, and it's Keep Your Guard Up down to the rail, leading the way from Chico Con Alex, just a neck in front. Goldie's boy is in third position. Tiny Tin, Pat's Factor trying to get underway on the inside. Pat's Factor now moves fourth within five of the speed up ahead. Laurel Ladd is next, and it's Strictly Business, and Manklin Creek trying to take a little closer order to the speed up ahead. Manklin Creek trailing now some 11 lengths off that pace. Keep your guard up, breaks away. Keep your guard up, rounding that far turn, but challenges are coming quickly now. Keep your guard up, a narrow lead as they round that far turn. Keep your guard up, is Goldie's boy on the outside as they round that turn with three furlongs left to go. They're in between horses, too. In between rivals, uh, trying to push on is Pat's Factor, who's moved closer. And now Pat's Factor in between horses at the top of the stretch, trying to push on by. As uh, so in the meantime, Goldie's boy is put to a drive. Keep your guard up under a stiff drive down to the rail. And Tiny Tin to the center of the track. They've got three sixteenths of a mile left to go. And it's Pat's Factor just in front. Pat's Factor battles with Goldie's boy. Tiny Tin. Tiny Tin on the outside at 30 to 1. Tiny Tin and Pat's Factor down to the inside. Tiny Tin, Jorge Ruiz looking for the big upset here. Pat's Factor, Tiny Tin, Pat's Factor battles back. Tiny Tin, Tiny Tin from Pat's Factor. And Manklin Creek from way back third.
Jeopardy race three. They're off. Good break for stay out at always something for the outside draws. Tequila Fog moving up on the inside, utterly enchanting, chiming in with early speed. Catch the sky away, running in fifth position. Promenade Princess and Have the Notion are next. And Creative Alibi in the back of the pack there. Some 10 from the speed up ahead. Stay out has company from utterly enchanting. And Tequila Fog backs off a bit in the inside in third position. Catch the sky is now in between horses. Three and a half from the front. Always something three path. They're followed by Promenade Princess as six to make up now as they head into the far turn creative alibi had the notion drops to last far turn runs stay out going strong stay out opening up now three lengths on utterly enchanting and then tequila fog and always something is in fourth catch the sky promenade princess saving ground with two and a half furlongs left to go creative alibi back of the pack with had the notion quarter of a mile left to go stay out with a solid advantage by six as they turn in stay out turns for home now six in front and has to run on now as stay out out, driven, opening up six, seven lengths, utterly enchanting center of the track. Now catch the skies, trying to pick up a share, has just moved a second, way on the outside has had the notion. Here is Stay Out. Stay Out is there to stay. Stay Out by eight. Stay Out from Catch the Sky and had the notion third and Promenade Princess. Stay Out and John Geraldo to do it. Minute seventeen sixty nine. Wait for live and let live to get straightened. And they're off. Paradise Song and Adelaide Miss out to the front. The outside is Double Fireball and Live and Let Live there in between horses tugging along too. Cupid Doll travels along in fifth and Taylor's Chrome is in the back of the outside, some six off for speed. Paradise Song the favorite ahead in front. Adelaide Miss trying to put some pressure on that one to the outside. Live and Let Live, bit more settled in in third position and Double Fireball. Here's Cupid Doll out of the inside starting to rally now. Cupid Doll's just three from the front while saving ground and Taylor's Chrome is in the back of the pack. Paradise Song with three furlongs left to go. Adelaide Miss right alongside and Live and Let Live looming up there while three wide. Cupid Doll is next and Double Fireball and Taylor's Chrome. Top of the stretch with a quarter of a mile left to go and it's Paradise Song down against that rail leading the way. Live and Let Live on the outside and in between horses Adelaide Miss giving way a bit. Three sixteenths of a mile left to go. Paradise Song still strong trying to turn back a challenge or Live and Let Live. Live and Let Live on the outside. Coming now at Paradise Song there on even terms with the 16th to go. Paradise Song, live and let live. Live and let live outside. Live and let live runs down Paradise Song. Live and let live until he doesn't do it. From Paradise Song, Kippy Doll, Adelaide Miss. Minute 11.81 the time.
Pick five. Loaded ready. And they're off. DC Fireman and Bono Solo wonder in firing up early speed. Day strike on the inside there. Revolutionary Road away running in the fifth spot. And Big Hambone on the far outside racing in six. And Smart Step is seventh, only five or six off the pace. Rock and Fellers follows that. Then I wish I was special from the outside post is about three wide. And at eight or nine off the pace, Mystic Times and trailing the field. Nautical Nature with no speed today. Into the far turn and three furlongs left to go. Around that turn now. And there goes Revolutionary Road on the outside. Revolutionary Road, a DC fireman. And a far outside there is Big Hambone Wonder in is next. And Bono Solo back in fifth. Day Strike is next. And Rock and Feller is DC fireman driven on the rail into the stretch. Revolutionary Road tries to counter right back. On the center of the track is Big Hambone. Next is Wonder in and fourth for a long left to go. Revolutionary Road is coming away with a lead now from Big Hambone second. Revolutionary. Revolutionary Road, Revolutionary Road by two from Big Hambone second. Wonder in close fourth nautical nature from the back of the pack with Rockin' Fellers. Eight, 11, and three. Revolutionary Road, seven to one. And they're off Mosler's touch out of the gate first. Tough one on the outside as early speed two. Claire's Darling pushing up to third position. Determined honor. Then Sudzy is next. Followed in between horses next by Mimu. And next in line is Thief of Dreams on the outside. Determined honor will settle down to the rail. As so they're two lengths back in the field and no chance given. Now the two path over to the inside. No chance given. They're followed by Vanquisher racing third to last position. America woman is back there and trailing the field is India Nichols. Into the far turn Mosler's touch. Pop the latches on top. Still got that lead by three quarters of a length. From tough win in pursuit in second. It's another three. Thief of Dreams on the outside. Try to advance and Claire's Darling down to the rail. In between horses next is Me Moo. Then Determined Honor going to be four wide as they turn in. And they're followed by Vanquisher widest of them all into the stretch. No chance given in traffic there. Has to wait at the 316s and it's Mosler's touch in front. Mosler's touch now kept the task with a three length lead. On the center of the track is Vanquisher is putting in a good bid to second. Vanquisher's coming on the outside with each and every stride. Here comes Vanquisher. Vanquisher and Crispin. Vanquisher takes the lead. Late stretch. Vanquisher to win a couple of lengths. Second was Mosler's touch. And then it was tough one. Followed by Thief of Dreams and a late run. No chance given. It was very unlucky.
and they're off. The Wolfman out of the gate first. Silent service, Golden Gullies are between horses with some early speed is Sula's Barbados, Eric's Empire, the red cap, not far from the front of between horses, and Accelerator is in the back, only five and a half lengths will cover them. It's the Wolfman with a speed three quarters of a length, Silent service, Sula's Barbados kept close to the inside in third, and Eric's Empire, Golden Gully taken back, Golden Gullies now back there in fifth, only four from the lead though, and Accelerator last of them all. The Wolfman in charge of the pace, it's a moderate clip into the far turn right on. It's the Wolfman, the one to catch. Silent service. Sula's Barbados down inside in third position. Eric's Empire in mid-pack in fourth. And on the outside is Golden Gully, who's three deep with three furlongs left to go now. An accelerator yet to move from the back of the pack. Midpoint of the turn, it's the Wolfman from Silent Service. The Wolfman's still there. Silent Service has to kick on now for the second spot. Sula's Barbados. Eric's Empire from in-between horses. The far, far outside accelerators try to get going. And no, center of the track, Accelerator's coming now with a bid. Here comes Accelerator on the far outside. Accelerator accelerating. It's the Wolfman trying to hold on to the lead. Accelerator on the outside under Sheldon Russell from last to first. Accelerator, the Wolfman fighting back for more. Accelerator to win it from the Wolfman. And then it was Silent Service and Sula's Barbados and Golden Gully. Six, seven, eight. Ready on Stronach 5, Friday. And they're off. Prince James wasting no time at all, showing that speed right to the lead. Al Brown and the Revenger up on the inside as early speed two. So there goes the Revenger taking narrow lead from Prince James, the opening furlong. Al Brown settles in in third position, chasing the speed absolved on the inside as in fourth Seagoes Gentleman Joe is on the clear on the outside and just four off that lead. Another two back of the field and Silent Malice is next and another five and flat out flying and Sassy King is way back. Got to be about 30 lengths off that pace. Heading over the far turn. Good pace going out there. The Revenger with plenty of pressure from Absolved on the inside and Prince James coming back for more on the outside. Al Brown travels in fourth and Gentleman Joe sweeping up on the far outside. About a five wide bid. Here comes Gentleman Joe on the far outside moving up four deep. Around that far turn with three and a half furlongs left to go. Gentleman Joe, Prince James, the Revenger and Al Brown and a four-way shake up up front. As other four lengths back and Silent Malice is Looming large now with three furlongs left to go. Absolved out of the inside of their six back and flat out flying and see Ghost and Sassy King and they make the turn in. The Revenger out of the inside trying to kick back for a little more from Prince James. The far outside Silent Malice set down and next is Absolved racing in fourth. Center of the track is flat out flying who's coming in for a share too. They're coming to the last furlong now. Prince James, Prince James from Silent Malice and flat out flying on the outside it's running a big race. 16 of a mile left to go. Prince James flat out flying on the outside. Trying to get there in time. Flat out flying on the outside. Prince James and flat out flying in a photo together.
In line. And they're off. Boss Live in confusion. Baby Boy with early speed and kiss the girls the outside up there to firing forward and Company Clown fourth on the far outside. So Boss Life's got that lead. Here's Twin Stink racing along in fifth now in between horses. Charge ahead is next in sixth. Exchange Fever is the gray seventh. They're followed by El Orojo and two doors down, followed by the exception. And then it's back to fine and dandy and a big gap back. Stand my ground and trailing the field as Little Bay is far back now. Heading into the far Far turn run, good pace going four for longs off to the line. Boss Life gets plenty of heat from Kiss the Girls is right there. And Company Clown up on the outside, three wide to join. Exchange Fever moves forward to the outside from fourth and charge ahead under pressure to stay pace in fifth. Confusion Baby Boy is next. They're followed by Twin Stink is lingering about six or seven off the pace. And then it's back to El Rojo and Fine and Dandy down to the inside. And Stand My Ground out wide but still far back and they're into the stretch now. And here's Company Clown who's set down. Company Clown opens up now three lengths on. Kiss the Girl second, then Exchange Fever third. Confusion Baby Boy for a share in fourth, and Fine and Dandy's next in fifth. And El Rojo down to the inside is Company Clown ridden out and rolling home in Lake Sea of Astronic Five. Company Clown and Alex Cintron to take it by four. Kiss the Girls is second. Fine and Dandy was third in Confusion Baby Boy. Stand my ground on the photo with El Rojo.